What's up everybody, Drew right back at it again with another video. Today we're going to be talking about Ready or Not because they just released another trailer. So I thought that I would just go through and like react to it. I'm not going to play the full thing for you. If you want to watch the full thing, I have a link to it in the description. Let's just go ahead and hop into it. I gotta say that this front part looks a lot like what we saw from the police station. Like the very front when he's walking out the door. Kind of looks like that, but it probably isn't this. Also, I just noticed that they're using CGI. They're not using actual in-game stuff. Whoa, what is this text up here? Why did they decide to use animations when they could have used in-game gameplay stuff? You notice that a lot of this stuff around here kind of looks like low quality, or is it just me? Like this looks like something out of Nintendo 64 right here. This just looks awkward from previous ready or not trailers it always looked a lot better like i feel like they didn't need to use the swat officers as cgi they could have just used gameplay but okay whatever and here we got our first villain i guess I'm wearing cat ears Wait, is that a face mask? What is that? I gotta say that this map right here that they're walking through kind of reminds me of um, that one farm map. It kind of looks like that, but it looks like they're still working on it because it looks kind of low quality. So this is obviously the streamer level that they're advertising and they're showing off what looks like a fake version of Discord here. Here's the camera setting. You can see like his room behind him. I don't know how much of this is actually going to be in game because it looks very CGI. I wonder what game this is supposed to be. It has like the things up at the corner. So maybe that's like Modern Warfare or I don't know. Or maybe it's supposed to be like a mock raid or not. Maybe it's Sandstorm? No idea. It's a bunch of computer parts on the thing right here. So maybe this is the streamer level. Maybe the streamer level is like a big level and they're just trying to look for the guy they called in or I don't know. Okay. See, this is why I think it's really weird because they're using CGI here instead of actual in-game stuff. So I'm not sure what this is supposed to mean. Maybe it's supposed to be we're arresting them for no freaking reason or what? So this guy's obviously mad about something, not too sure what. Oh, maybe you're in my shot, you're doing something dumb, or I don't know. I will say this, she's holding this box a little weird. No, they looked heavily confused throughout this trailer. What's this on the TV we see here? Is this like another streamer? Uh, well, I mean, this kind of looks like YouTube 808 Sueños. Are these like a gang member? I'm a bit confused. We're seeing a little bit more of this streamer's room. Oh, he just threw a can at that TV right there, I think. Maybe this is like his mom or something? And the swatch just standing there like, oh, snap. The trailer didn't really say too much about what it was really about. I mean, I guess that it is just the streamer mission, right? But I kind of wish that they didn't do it in CGI. I would have liked to have seen it in gameplay exploring the place because it just would have looked a lot better. But that's just me. But underneath this, it says introducing streamer, our ambitious upcoming map that will be available with the arrival of 1.0 release. Huh? 1.0 release? When the hell is that going to be? I mean, that didn't exactly give us a date as far as I can tell. No, no date. This might actually give us a little more context here. The phone rings. A young man is on the other side. He informs that he's planning to kill his mother, brother, and take hostages as well. In no time, SWAT moves to the location. Probably a prank call right here to get this streamer swatted, but I have a feeling, just judging by the way that he looks and how he acts in the trailer, he probably has something that incriminates him in the background that's actually going to get him in trouble, if I had to guess. In the meantime, Milky Toes, also known as Michael Williams, is getting ready to begin his regular streaming session. However, However, he is unaware that one of his fans has just made a prank call to the police station. While Milky Toes yells at his mother to get out of the frame, the SWAT team arrives, only to be welcomed not by Michael, but his illegal Bitcoin farm. Oh, poor Michael, you won't be able to continue your streams from prison. Okay, so this gives a lot of context to a trailer that really didn't, uh, that I didn't really quite understand. So I guess this is why the SWAT was like stopping here to see all this stuff. So this is what that was. I was a bit confused. I'm not all too familiar with Bitcoin farms and all that are bitcoin farms actually illegal i don't even know yes bitcoin mining is completely legal in the united states mining other cryptos is not prohibited either okay that's interesting maybe it's illegal in the ready or not world i guess but there was also a bit of a newsletter that came with this so let's go ahead and go through that streamer 
a silly prank, an illegal crypto mining activity, and a young individual that learned about life's consequences the hard law enforcement way, including streamer, our ambitious upcoming map that will be available with the arrival of 1.0 release. A bunch of people were asking if this was just going to be like a freebie map, like you go in and clearing out a bunch of like civilians and just arresting the streamer and that would be that. But Rapolio from their discord says that there will be friends that we have to deal with. So it might not be a cakewalk. There'll probably be some people with guns in there protecting the bit farm, even though I don't know if bit farm in real life is actually illegal. I don't think it is as far as I know, but anyways. So this has been a long time coming from, you know, the game. Like people have always hinted at like a streamer level. And uh, I mean, if, if, for those of you that don't know, this is centered around swatting streamers, which was a big thing for a while until somebody actually got arrested for, you know, calling up SWAT to SWAT someone. It still happens, but not as much as it used to because there are consequences for doing something like that. But yeah, it's pretty cool that we're actually getting this type of level. I'm hoping that it's going to be like one of the beginner levels that you do whenever you're doing the campaign, get you familiar with the game a little bit because this does feel like a bit of a freebie type of level. But uh, yeah, so I think this kind of brings up like a big question of um, when is 1.0 going to release? I hope it's not going to release for a while because there's still a lot of content that they need to add to the game and I don't know that they're actually ready or not. Get it? But yeah, they still have to add you know multiplayer they have to add the campaign they have to do all this stuff but they're really hinting at a big update at some point i'm just hoping that it actually hits the mark and we'll be able to play everything per se you know but yeah that's pretty cool let me know what your guys' thoughts are down below and uh yeah that's all i really got to say about this i guess i'll catch you in the next one Bye bye